What up, what up, it's Dane, and in this video I'm going to be telling you if cardio impairs your muscle growth, right? So, should you be, should you stop doing cardio, or should you continue doing cardio while building muscle, right? I know a lot of people ask this question, so I thought I'd cover it in this video. Okay, so, if you think about it, you can't be a elite, um, say, marathon runner and an elite bodybuilder, stuff like this, right? It just can't happen. You need to pick one. So, I'm guessing you're aim is to build maximum amount of muscle right, maximum muscular hypertrophy I'm guessing that's your aim and my recommendation and from the research I've done it really doesn't matter too much but here's my answer to does cardio impair muscle growth yes no and maybe <laughs> it will impair your muscle growth if you do too much of it and your calories are not in check and no it won't because if you train right if you do it uh, setting the amount of cardio spaced out it will not affect your muscle growth and so why have I said that basically I've said it, it definitely will affect your muscle growth right, if if this is the case if you're in a calorie deficit which means you're not having enough calories for your body to basically ma maintain its you know bodily functions you will start losing fat your energy levels will be affected your workouts will suffer and then you're still doing like five times of cardio per week and then your protein intake is not high enough that's when you will start losing muscle, right? Once your exercise activity increases, your protein intake needs to increase as well. Same as if your body fat level drops, your protein intake needs to increase as well, right? So for someone that's like 9% body fat, they need to have more protein intake than someone that's say 15% body fat and they're doing the same exercise. Stuff like this, there are other factors, but that's just like a baseline, right? So that's when cardio will affect your muscle growth or impair your muscle growth. On the other side of the spectrum, it won't affect your muscle growth if you have your calories in check, your protein intake in check. There's no reason it should. One thing to mention though is don't go too hard on the cardio because like I said before at the start of the video, your main focus is bodybuilding, right? You want to gain the most amount of muscle as possible. So here's my solution. Space cardio between the week, right? So do cardio like Monday, Wednesday, Sunday. Three times a week is fine. This allows you to still recover optimally for also building muscle right because like I said the main focus is building muscle one thing to mention as well that if you're in a calorie deficit you need to be doing cardio that's low impact right for example you can't just do like real intense running sprints and then the next day you do legs and then the next day you do sprints and that, that will impair muscle growth because recovery will be affected right so basically to summarize the whole video just to make it sweet, sweet, sweet short and concise Cardio will not impair your muscle growth if you do it right. If you just do it like three times a week, space out between a week, and get enough nutrients in, do low impact cardio. If you're in a calorie deficit, keep protein intake a bit higher, about 1.2 grams per pound of body weight should be fine. And also important to note that just because you're eating more protein doesn't mean it affects your bodily system. It's just gonna be used as excess energy. It's not gonna affect the liver, the kidneys, shit like this. So anyway, those are my two solutions or options even. Cardio does not impair muscle growth in some circumstances, but it does in others. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you find it useful. Subscribe down below, comment. I love to use suggestions. Make sure to check out all my other videos on the channel about cardio, building muscle, nutrition, and more importantly, stay positive, stay smiling, and I'll see you in the next one.